What is normal HbA1c by age? If you find this information helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and share it with others who may benefit. Also, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more informative content on diabetes management. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we aim to provide reliable and up-to-date information about diabetes. Today, we're going to discuss a topic that's of great importance to anyone managing diabetes. What is normal HbA1c by age? Before we dive into the details, let's explain what HbA1c is. HbA1c, also known as glycated hemoglobin, is a form of hemoglobin that is chemically linked to sugar. The higher the level of glucose in the blood, the higher the level of HbA1c. This test is used to measure how well your body is managing blood sugars over a period of time, typically about 2-3 months. Why is HbA1c important? The HbA1c test is important because it provides a long-term record of blood sugar levels, which is crucial for the doctor to decide whether the diabetes treatment plan is working or needs adjustment. It can also help in the early diagnosis of diabetes. Normal HbA1c levels by age. Now, let's discuss what the normal HbA1c levels should be. It's important to understand that while there is a general range considered normal, these values can slightly vary depending on the age of the individual. Generally speaking, for people without diabetes, the normal range for the hemoglobin A1c level is between 4% and 5.6%. HbA1c levels between 5.7% and 6.4% mean you have a higher chance of getting diabetes. Levels of 6.5% or higher mean you have diabetes. Children and young adults. In children and young adults, the goal is to have an HbA1c level below 7.5%. However, this can be adjusted based on the individual's history of hypoglycemia, the duration of diabetes, and the individual's age. For healthy adults, the ideal HbA1c level should be below 7%. However, for some adults, particularly those with other medical conditions, a slightly higher HbA1c target may be appropriate. Elderly In elderly patients, especially those with long-standing diabetes, the goal HbA1c level may be up to 8%. This is because tighter control may lead to a greater risk of hypoglycemia, which can be dangerous in older individuals. How to maintain a normal HbA1c level So, how do we maintain a normal HbA1c level? Regular monitoring of blood glucose levels, a healthy diet, regular physical activity, and proper adherence to medication if prescribed, are the key steps. It's also important to have regular checkups with your doctor, so any changes in your HbA1c levels can be addressed promptly. Remember. The HbA1c test is a vital tool in managing and diagnosing diabetes, and understanding your results can help you better control your condition. Everyone is different, and the normal HbA1c level can vary by individual, so always consult with your healthcare provider to determine your own target levels. That's all for today. If you found this video helpful, do give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos about diabetes. See you in our next video. Stay healthy, stay informed.